Hi, you clicked on this link because you want to know how to take an x-ray of the heel or oscalsis, and I'm going to show you how to do it perfectly every time. All right, so this is an x-ray of the heel. We do two views on that. It's an axial, which it's set up for right now, and then we do a lateral. So the axial, the way we set up for the axial is we put a 45 degree angle on the tube. We have the patient flex their foot back as far as they possibly can, and we're gonna enter right here, kind of at the midpoint where the, os where the heel is, right there. Have them be straight up. And for this, you can come down pretty tight because it's just all air on the outside. So as long as you have, as long as you have light on each side, you'll be fine. Foot is flexed all the way up and you're gonna center right here, kind of at the base of the, midway between the base and the top of the, the oscalsis. So that's the first view. Second view and last view is gonna be a lateral. And the way we do the lateral here is the same way we do the lateral for the foot and the ankle. So we're just gonna turn the patient this way. I find it's much easier to move the mattress than it is to try to explain it to the patient how they should move since most of them haven't done the exam before. So it's very easy to move, move everything around so you can get it to line up to look nice. And you can come down pretty tight also. Oh, it's almost a 45 degree angle, but you wanna enter, you want the line to go from here to, to about here where the, the foot and the lower leg, the, oh, I'm sorry, the ankle intersect. So you're gonna shoot it like this, marker, and you're all done. And those are the two views for oscalsis view. Thanks so much for watching, and if you like the video, please like, comment, and subscribe.